Welcome back to Proper PE, lesson number four, with me, Mr. Deneen, in my back garden. Proper PE is PE following the national curriculum, as we've done in the previous three. If you haven't watched the previous three, go and have a look at them after this video. So, all you need today to start off with is a towel, just like mine, make sure it's a big towel, and we don't want it to be wet, because you're gonna be lying on it later. So go and find yourself a towel, You've got one minute to do that, starting from now. Go, 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 go. your back hopefully you've got your towel now we don't need our towel for now you can pull that down to the sides so let's get on with our warm-up this week's warm-up is going to be themed around mr. men there's some great stories in mr. men and the little miss series so make sure you check some of those books out really good books okay so to start off with we're going to be mr. rush you guessed it at home that means we're gonna be super speedy so let's go super speedy on the spot mr. rush really really fast Pumping those arms, pumping those legs. Mr. Rush, excellent, stop there. So if I say Mr. Rush, we're gonna go as fast as we possibly can on the spot, using our arms, using our legs. Now, the opposite to Mr. Rush is Mr. Slow. So we're gonna do the exact same thing again, but this time we're gonna do it super slow. So, moving our arms, moving our legs. Mr. Slow, really slowly. It's the opposite to Mr. Rush. So Mr. Rush, really fast. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And Mr. Slow. Brilliant. Okay, so our first two characters, Mr. Rush and Mr. Slow. So, next one I'm gonna introduce is Mr. Small. So we need to get down on the floor, keep on our feet though, put our hands down. We're making ourselves really, really small. So Mr. Small, we're gonna move around, walking around with our legs and our hands, just like this, you can go sideways and backwards. To the side, forwards again. It's so Mr. Small, brilliant. Up on your feet again. The opposite to small is being really, really tall. So Mr. Tall, can be on his toes. Hands up for me. And we're gonna walk around on our toes. Just keep walking around to the side. And forwards, backwards, to the side again. Keep moving around. Excellent. What was that one called again? Mr. Tall. Fantastic. So, Mr. Tall is really tall. Mr. Small is really small. Brilliant. Okay. Next Mr. Man we're going to introduce is going to be Mr. Jelly. So, Mr. Jelly, you can be wobbling around. Mr. Jelly, wobble your legs, wobble your arms. Wobble, wobble, wobble. Mr. Jelly. Brilliant. So, if I say Mr. Jelly, I'm going to wobble around. Wobble, 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 just like Mr. Jelly. And finally, to finish our Mr. Men series, it's Mr. Bounce. So Mr. Bounce, pretend you're on a trampoline and bounce really high. Mr. Bounce. Fantastic. Okay, so I'm going to introduce another one in a little while. But for now, I want you to show me Mr. Rush. Let's go. <laughs> Mr. Rush, move those arms, move those legs. Mr. Rush, Mr. Slow, Mr. Slow, really slow for Mr. Slow, brilliant, Mr. Small, get down for me, get walking around, it's Mr. Small, brilliant, Mr. Tall, walking around is Mr. Tall, might even get a little bit of a jog in there as well, Mr. Tall, 
Brilliant, and Mr. Jelly. Whoa, 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 Mr. Rush again. Excellent, and Mr. Bounce. Whew. Keep bouncing at home. Excellent, brilliant warm up. Well done, everybody. We're going to finish with one character, which is Middle Little Miss Sunshine. So we're going to make massive sunshines to get our arms warm. Massive circles, like the sun. Little Miss Sunshine, brilliant job. Fantastic, good. Can you balance on one leg for me? Can you balance on the other leg? Brilliant, keep it going. This time trickier challenge, we're gonna balance and hop in between. So, hop onto the other leg, and hop again and balance. Hop again. Hop again, and hop, and balance there for me. This time, we're gonna to touch our nose. Touching our nose, and away, touch our other nose. Touch our nose again, changing hands. Whoa, tricky, keep going. Change foot for me. Using our finger to touch our nose. Keep using that different finger. Keep trying to balance. Brilliant job, warm up complete. You are ready to move on. Brilliant at home, well done. Okay, it's time for the skill station. So this week in the skill station, I've been jo joined by my cat, Joey. I'm sure he'll go in a minute, so don't worry. You need to grab your towel from earlier. So Joey, out of the way, please. Out of the way, Joey. Thank you. Joey's gone, good. So you need the towel. And your towel needs to be lying down. I'm gonna put mine on the side so you can see me on the camera. So today, we're going to do gymnastics. We're going to do lots of different shapes. Okay, so we're going to start off with the L shape. So, you can sit on your bottom, on your towel. Good. And stretch your legs out. And make sure your legs are together. Put them together. Good. And then my hands are going to go up. Put myself into a capital U, a L. I'm going to make sure my back is really straight. I should be able to feel it in my tummy muscles in here on my abs. It's nice and straight, legs are straight, arms are straight. We're going to hold that for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Great job. Next one is going to be a tuck shape. So it means we're going to tuck ourselves into our body. So I'm going to bring up my legs. Make sure they're nice and flat on the floor, just like that, good. And then my chin is gonna go to my knees and I'm gonna hold my legs. I'm not gonna hold them too tightly. I don't want to push them together. I'm just gonna hold on to them so I can tuck my body in, tuck my chin in and hold. For five, four, three, two, one, zero. Good, so that one's called our tuck shape brilliant next one we're going to do is a pencil shape we're going to make ourselves look like a pencil so we're going to lie on our backs down on our backs excellent i'm going to put my my legs together so my feet together at the end there good i'm going to extend my arms back behind me i'm going to put my hands together and i'm going to hold that pose for five seconds this is my pencil shape five four three two one zero excellent that's our pencil shape so three done so far brilliant job next one is going to be our pike let's get yourself back on the mat again bum on the mat legs on the mat there we go legs straight again like we did for our l shape and we're going to have our legs together feet together and this time our hands are going to go straight in front of us just like that put them together and again make sure your back is nice and straight you can feel it in your tummy muscles feel it in the back here it should be nice and straight and we're going to hold that there for me for five four three two one zero excellent that was our pike shape brilliant job so next one is our straddle shape now for this one Gonna make sure our legs are nice and wide but if it starts to hurt on your legs don't move them any further 
Okay, some people will be able to move their legs quite wide. Some people won't be able to move them very wide at all. Mine's sort of in the middle. I'm sure at home, yours are a lot better than mine. So, where it feels comfortable for you. And there we go. Our next job, our hands are gonna be pointing towards our toes, like so. Keep them nice and straight, and your back straight as before. You should be able to feel it in your tummy muscles on the top of your legs. Here we go, and hold it there for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Brilliant job. Now, we're going to be the pencil again. We're gonna stand up and do it. So standing on your mat. Stand it up for me. So feet together, nice and straight. Make sure your back isn't arched over. Make sure your back is nice and straight. Push your chest out. There we go, brilliant. And then we're gonna put our hands up. Join them again together from above your head and hold it for five seconds. So five, four, three, two, one. Zero, brilliant job. And to finish off with our gymnastic shapes, we're going to go into a star position. So, legs apart, as wide as you can so they feel comfortable. And our hands are going to go straight. Nice and straight, like if you're an aeroplane. We're going to hold that position for five seconds. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Brilliant job at home, well done. Okay, so, I'm gonna test you now. I'm gonna say one of the shapes, and I want you at home to get into that shape, and then I'll do it a few seconds later. So get to see if you've remembered all of our shapes. Okay, so, first shape I want you to get into at home is our L shape. Capital O. Okay, hopefully you've got it at home, I'm going to do it now, you should be on your bum, you should have your legs flat, put your feet together and your legs together, just like so, your arms are going to go up above your head to make the cuttle out, and you're going to make sure your back straight and your tummy muscles are making you nice and straight, you're feeling your tummy muscles and you're holding it just there for me, brilliant, next shape I want you to get into, is the tuck shape. Off you go at home, get into it for me. A few seconds to do that. Okay, so a tuck shape should be on your bottom again. With your legs up. You've got to angle in your knees, bend your knees, in like that. I'm gonna put, tuck my chin in to my knees, and I put my hands on my legs like so, and hold it. That's our tuck shape. Last one to do before we move on today. Last challenge I'm gonna give you is our straddle shape. Can you get into a straddle shape at home? Off you go. Couple of seconds to do that. Fantastic. And watching me to make sure. So on your bum again. Legs wide, as wide as you can put them so it doesn't feel painful if it starts to hurt. Don't do it any further. There we go. Back up straight, arms nice and straight, pointing towards your toes, and we're holding it in that position for our straddle position, our straddle shape. Excellent job at home. Give yourself a round of applause. That's the skill station done. You can get rid of your towel for now. Get rid of your towel, put it to the side. Brilliant. And I want you to show me the Mr. Men again. So I want to see Mr. Rush. Mr. Slow, Mr. Small, Mr. Tall, or oh, trouble with Mr. Tall, Mr. Bounce, Little Miss Sunshine, and my favourite one, Mr. Jelly. Not so wobbly. Wobble, 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 wobble. Wobble, wobble, wobble. Excellent job, everybody. Well done. Okay, next station is a little bit different today. We're going to do the cha-cha slide like we've done before, but with a plank challenge. So, remember that plank. So we get down, we're on our hands, 
and our feet are up and we hold it there or we put our elbows down we get into that plank position so today we're going to do a cha-cha slide but by doing those planks now a few things to explain before we start with your plank i'm going to do it on the side to show you i want you to do it with your hands today not your elbows that will help us make it easier on your hands with your feet and we keep our back really straight or you can choose to go on your knees that's okay too you might go on your knees and hold that position there trying to keep yourself nice and straight it's your choice i'm gonna come back on my side to show you now so there's a few moves we're gonna practice first so when we get to it in a second we play the music you'll be much better at it at home so into the plank position on your knees on your feet your, your choice now when the song says clap your hands you're gonna tap your shoulders so clap your hands there we go excellent next job so when it says we're gonna to move to the left or move to the right we're just gonna move our hands and our feet so I'll show you again just move to the left there we go or take it back we're gonna go backwards there we go so we're staying in our plank position all the time and finally it's gonna say cha cha and when we cha cha we're gonna move our knees just like a mountain climber that we've done before Move our knees, cha cha, moving our knees, just like so. Okay? Now, it is a tricky challenge today. So, if you want to go on your knees, it's absolutely fine. And you might even start on your feet and then go down to your knees. That's also fine, okay? It will get a bit tricky, but this is all about perseverance and determination to keep going, okay? Ready to go? So, into your plank position. Let's get ready. The first thing to do is you're going to clap your hands. Here we go, clap your hands. Here we go. Good job at home. Keep going. Here we go to the left. We're going to go backwards. One hop, which is your left. And again. And knee. Keep going. Turn the left for me. And take it back. And hop with your leg. And again. Left foot. And cha cha. To the right. To the left. Take it back. One hop. Jump if you can. Red foot. Left foot. Side to the left. Side to the right. Crisscross and we'll keep it there. Fantastic at home. Brilliant job. Big clap. Now that is really tough. It's really tough on your shoulders. It's really tough on your legs. Most importantly, it's really good for your core and your abs. It's a fantastic job at home. Give yourself a round of applause. Brilliant. Touch your head. Touch your knees. Touch your shoulders. Touch your toes. Touch your back. Spin on the spot. And touch your head again. Touch your knees, touch your toes, touch your back, touch your ears, touch your tummy, touch your head, touch your knees, sprint it again, touch your knees. Oh, did I catch you out? I hope so. I love catching you out at home. Brilliant. Okay, so now it's time for our five minute workout. And to start off, off for the whole of today's five minute workout, it's going to be all about animals. It's going to be different animals for 30 seconds of hard work. Are we ready to go? So the first one, is a cheetah. So cheetah's gonna be as fast as you can. I'm sure you guessed that at home. We ready? 30 seconds, sprinting on the spot, as fast as you can go. Starting from, now let's go. Sprinting at home, sprinting, sprinting, and slow it down. Cheetah's gonna jog. And sprinting again, sprinting, keep going. Jogging again, jogging, and sprinting again really fast. Pump those arms for me, and jogging again. Jogging, jogging, catch animal. 10 seconds to go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. Shake it all off. Fantastic job. Next one, we are going to be a snake. Just gonna get down on the ground. On our tummies. Into position, fantastic. 
We get our arms out. We're gonna wriggle them around like a snake for 30 seconds. You ready at home? Let's go, 30 seconds. Wriggling like a snake. Keep wriggling for me. Keep moving. Just like a snake. Gonna have a snake hissing sound from anybody at home. Has anyone got one? Brilliant. Keep being a snake for me. Keep going. Keep going. And five, four, three, two, one, zero. Up you get. Brilliant job. Next animal in our animal workout is going to be a monkey. So, monkeys like to get down and have their arms up. And we're going to move around. It's a bit like a squat. I'm getting down to my squat position. And I'm putting my arms out and we're going to move. Are we ready? 30 seconds. Start. Now let's go. Moving around like a monkey. Moving around. Keep that back straight if you can. Keep that back really straight. Keep moving around. Fantastic. Brilliant at home. Keep going. It's a bit tricky. Keep persevering. Keep being determined. 10 seconds to go. Keep going for me. Keep being a monkey. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. Brilliant job. Next one is on our feet again. We're gonna be a crocodile or an alligator. And they have big, wide mouths. So we're gonna snap and catch as many flies in our mouth as we possibly can. You ready at home? Get those alligator mouths ready. Three, two, one. Let's go, snap for two. And snap for two again. Keep switching. You might do this when you're walking as well. Keep doing it for me. Keep going. Keep snapping those mouths together, those big crunchy teeth. Keep catching those flies over here, up here, over there, down there. Keep going. Keep snapping, snapping those teeth together on five, four, three, two, one, zero. Fantastic job, brilliant job. And the last one, we're going to be a giraffe. So on our tiptoes, and we're going to reach for lots of leaves off of the trees. Giraffes like to grab leaves. We ready? 30 seconds of hard work. Keep going for me at home. Start from now on your tiptoes, grabbing those leaves. See how many leaves you can catch at home for me. Keep going, keep moving around, grabbing those leaves. I'm gonna jump for some as well. Brilliant, keep on your tiptoes, grabbing those leaves. Well done at home, keep moving. Keep moving, grabbing those leaves for me. Stay on those tiptoes. We're nearly there, we've nearly done it guys. Keep going, five. Four, three, two, one, zero. Big round of applause. Fantastic job at home, brilliant. Excellent job today, guys, in proper PE. We have come to the last part of our lesson, which as you know, is our dance party. Looking forward to the dance party today. But first off, shout out, big shout out to North Hinksy Primary School. I know lots of you have been doing that. Fantastic work. Thank you, Mrs. Colucci for showing everybody and promoting a video, fantastic. And then, as always, Dolphins class, fantastic work, keep it up Dolphins. Hope you have a great Easter break. And also, West Whitney Primary School, big up to you guys for doing the videos too, fantastic. Okay, now it's time for our dance party. And today, we're gonna be dancing to I'm Still Standing. I love this song. I'm just going to go and play the song. Get yourself ready at home. Get those arms going for me then. Let's go. Brilliant start at home. And get ready. Here we go. Marching for me. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. Shimmy in. And behind that mask you. Kicking out for me. Brilliant. 
Brilliant, here we go. Love this bit, little kid. Close cross. Freaking excellent. Skip it again for me. Shimmy it again. Crown by now. Crisscross. Keep going, keep moving. Crisscross again, love this bit. Pieces, pieces on my mind. Arms up. Arms up again. Play like a tough me at home. On your knees, play like a guitar. Brilliant, keep going like a guitar. And get ready again to dance, here we go. Chris Cross. Pieces, pieces, oh my mind. Get those arms in. I'm still standing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fantastic. Brilliant job at home. Right, you had fun with that one. I love that one today. I'm still standing. I've been Mr. Deneen. This is proper PE with Mr. Deneen. Lesson four. Round of applause everybody at home, thanks for joining in again, well done.